Operating systems are the unsung heroes of computing. They manage hardware, run applications, and ensure everything works seamlessly. But did you know there are different types of operating systems designed for specific tasks? In today's video, we'll dive into batch, time sharing, distributed, real time, and embedded operating systems. By the end, you'll understand their unique roles in technology. And stick around, because I'll also share how GoLogin, the best browser for multi accounting, can make your online life easier and more secure. Let's start with batch operating systems. In the early days of computing, users submitted tasks in batches. The operating system executed these tasks sequentially, one after another. This approach is still used in environments like data processing centers. Pros, efficient for repetitive tasks like payroll processing. Cons, there's no interaction between the user and the system while tasks are running. While batch systems aren't as common in everyday use today, they've paved the way for modern multitasking. Next, we have time-sharing operating systems. Here, multiple users can access a single system simultaneously. The OS allocates a specific time slice to each task, making it feel like everyone has their own computer. Examples, early mainframes use time-sharing to let multiple people work on the same machine. Modern-day cloud servers are an evolution of this concept. Benefit, time-sharing maximizes resource utilization but can experience delays if too many users are active at once. Before we move on to distributed and real-time systems, let me introduce you to GoLogin. Ever struggled to manage multiple accounts for work, social media, or e-commerce? GoLogin, the best browser for multi-accounting, is here to help. With GoLogin, you can easily switch between accounts without logging in and out. It keeps your browsing secure and private making it perfect for freelancers, entrepreneurs, and anyone juggling multiple profiles. Check out the link in the description to learn how GoLogin can transform your online experience. Now, let's talk about distributed operating systems. This type of OS connects multiple computers to work as a single system. It's the backbone of technologies like cloud computing and big data processing. Examples, Hadoop and Apache Spark are examples of distributed systems. They help manage and process enormous data sets across multiple machines. Distributed systems are powerful and scalable, but can be complex to manage. Real-time operating systems, RTOS, prioritize tasks based on deadlines. They're used in critical systems where timing is everything, like air traffic control or medical devices. Embedded operating systems are designed for specific hardware, like your smart TV or a washing machine. Key difference. RTOS focuses on timing and precision. Embedded systems focus on functionality and hardware integration. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for part two.